about a month ago, I got a new job. It's a high ticket closer for an online marketing agency. And I've been noticing recently that I'm getting the I need to think about it objection a lot at the end of my sales calls. So today at the end of the day, I'm like, I'm going to do a little research, trying to find a way, a solution to stop getting that and, you know, find a solution. And the, the strategy is just to address it at the start of the call. That way it doesn't comes up, come up at the end. So at the end of my day, update the sales script. And then I'm like, I'm going to take a shower today was, you know, it wasn't that long of a day, but yesterday was really intense. And I'm like, I just need the, I feel the need to relax. So I'm going to go take a shower, relax, enjoy the evening. And as I enter the bathroom and I pass by the mirror, I'm like, Ooh, let me just practice quickly. That way I can look at my reflection and, you know, see my facial expression and my body language and things like that and get an idea of how it's going to come across to the clients or prospects rather. So I end up standing there for maybe 10 minutes, just, you know, practicing and adjusting the wording and things like that. And at some point it hits me and I realize, hold on, I'm standing in the bathroom, staring at myself in the mirror, repeating the same thing over and over again. And I'm naked because I'm about to take a shower. Now already that is kind of weird in and of itself, but I take it to that next level because instead of just keeping that story to myself, the first thing that I do after I'm done taking my shower is I tell this very story to my boss. Now I haven't gotten his reaction yet, but I'm assuming he's going to find it pretty funny. <laughs> Either that or I'll get fired. <laughs> no, definitely not. But you know, it's just this experience reminded me that for the last month or so since I got this job and I've been studying actually the last six months, since I've been back in Canada and having to do all these things of like, hey, maybe I have cancer, I have to renew my driver's license, I have to new, renew my medical card, I have to find an apartment, I have to find a job, I have to find an online job so I can go back to Nicaragua and be with my girlfriend to begin the immigration process. I need to find a new apartment because the person who's currently subletting this apartment is going to move back in in about a week and a half. So there's always been a lot of things going on lately and there's a lot of pressure and a lot of stress. And because of that, I've been so focused on the objective at hand that I kind of forgot to be myself. I forgot to just have fun and do things that I enjoy and doing very random things like practicing a script naked in the bathroom and then going to tell my boss about it is something that is very, very me, very unique, very strange, very hopefully entertaining. We'll see. <laughs> but it's just it, this experience made me realize I miss that person. I miss that version of me. And I really need to get back to that. And one of the ways for me to do that and kind of to take things to that next level. So is to record a video and post on YouTube. So you know, instead of just talking to myself naked in the bathroom, I'm like, I'm going to talk naked to myself in the bathroom, go tell my boss about it, and then record a video about it and go post that on YouTube. That is the kind of person I want to be simply because it's fun. It's like, it just proves to myself, like, I don't care what anyone thinks. If it's funny, I'm going to share it. I want to share my humor, my <laughs> stupidity sometimes with other people, just because that's what I enjoy. That was the whole point of my travels last year. That's why I sold everything to travel the world. I wanted to have adventures. I want to be able to share those stories with the people that I care about. And lately, the last six months, I haven't really shared anything because I've been so focused and I lost that that zest for life, really. And now I feel like it's finally starting to come back. So I just wanted to make a quick video, share that kind of ridiculous story and say, it's been a while, but I'm back. <laughs>